Prepare for an extraordinary exploration into a topic that has fascinated space enthusiasts for years. Pluto, the ninth planet of our solar system, was discovered in 1930 by astronomer Clyde Tombaugh. For nearly seven decades, it was taught and accepted as a planet in classrooms around the world. Join us as we embark on a journey to uncover the truth behind the reclassification of Pluto and why it is no longer considered a planet. Get ready to delve into the captivating tale of how Pluto's status went from that of a planet to a celestial enigma. In 2006, Pluto's planetary status was challenged, leaving scientists and space enthusiasts wondering about the reasons behind this cosmic demotion. The International Astronomical Union, or IAU, played a pivotal role in this groundbreaking decision. So why did they make this monumental change? Brace yourself for reason number one, and it's a real eye-opener. Pluto's companions from beyond our world contributed to its downfall. Astronomers made a remarkable discovery known as the Kuiper Belt, an area filled with icy bodies located beyond Neptune. This revelation shattered the belief that Pluto existed alone in its cosmic realm. Suddenly, numerous Pluto-like objects emerged, demanding recognition. It was akin to a colossal cosmic invasion. As it turns out, size does matter when it comes to planetary classification. In the past, Pluto was considered the ninth planet, but as technology advanced, astronomers discovered that it was relatively small compared to other planets. In fact, it is even smaller than our moon. Consequently, the IAU formulated a new definition for a planet and unfortunately, Pluto did not meet the criteria. The IAU also sought to tidy up our cosmic neighborhood. They recognized that labeling Pluto as a planet could potentially lead to an influx of hundreds of new planets, complicating our understanding of the solar system. Therefore, to maintain scientific clarity, they had to make some difficult decisions. Pluto's peculiar orbit played a significant role in its reclassification. While the eight traditional planets orbit the Sun in a relatively flat plane, Pluto's orbit is tilted and elongated. It rebelliously defied the norm, making astronomers question whether it truly deserved the planet label. And now, the moment we've all been waiting for. Reason number 5. Pluto's heartbreaking demotion. In 2006, the IAU announced that a celestial body must fulfill three criteria to be considered a planet. It must orbit the Sun, have a spherical shape, and clear its orbit of other debris. Sadly, Pluto failed to meet this last requirement. The Kuiper Belt contains numerous icy bodies, some even larger than Pluto itself, resulting in our beloved celestial misfit losing its planetary status. Although Pluto may no longer be considered a planet, it remains an extraordinary world worthy of exploration. Spacecraft like NASA's New Horizons have captured breathtaking images and gathered invaluable data about this distant dwarf planet. Who knows what surprises we may uncover in the future that could reshape our perception once again. And there you have it, dear audience, the captivating story of why Pluto is no longer classified as a planet. From its cosmic neighborhood to its peculiar orbit, the reasons behind its demotion are truly astounding. So let us celebrate the unique allure of Pluto and keep our gaze fixed on the ever-expanding cosmos. Thank you for joining us today. Remember to show your support by liking, subscribing, and hitting that notification bell for more mind-boggling mysteries. Until next time, stay curious and continue exploring the vast universe.